California is close to adding another category to its anti-discrimination laws. Plus, smoke from wildfires north of the Bay Area is really impacting our air quality. That and more coming up. Hi everyone, Dina San Juan here bringing you some of our top stories. Let's get you synced in. We're going to start in the East Bay where a Contra Costa County bartender and bouncer was charged with raping seven women. Police say 35-year-old Brandon De La Quadri of Wana Creek preyed on intoxicated women and the alleged assaults date back to 2018. Certainly this was someone who took advantage of, of people in um, often in vulnerable situations and appeared to be looking for people in vulnerable situations and targeting them in, in that situation. So definitely a, a danger to the community. We spoke to a woman who says she was his most recent victim, and she described the attack saying he used alcohol, physical intimidation, and manipulation to commit the crimes. Walnut Creek police believe De La Quadri may have more victims, and they urge anyone who thinks they were victimized to come forward. Switching gears now to some statewide news, California is just one vote away from becoming the first state ever to ban caste discrimination. Let me explain exactly what this is. It's a 3,000-year-old system of social hierarchy that was popular in India, and though now outlawed there, it's migrated over to the United States. Many people here have been fighting to add caste as a protected category under California's anti-discrimination laws. Well, that proposed bill is just one vote away from Governor Newsom's desk. NBC Bay Area's Jessica Aguirre sat down with a woman who left her senior manager position at Google over concerns about caste discrimination. She says it all started when she tried to organize a talk about the subject, but she said Google postponed the discussion after employees said they felt unsafe. You can watch that interview, plus learn more about the caste system on our website. Visit NBCBayArea.com slash Race in America. Well, if you've been outside, you've probably noticed just how hazy and kind of smoky the sky was Wednesday, and that's prompted air district officials to extend an air quality advisory through Thursday. The smoke is coming from wildfires burning near the northern part of the state and Oregon, so we should expect the air quality to be on the low to moderate levels. Those sensitive to the smoke should limit the amount of time they spend outside because it can cause irritated eyes, coughing, scratchy throat, all that stuff you don't want. For more of the air quality in your area, go to NBCBayArea.com slash weather. Also, don't forget to download our free NBC Bay Area app for weather updates straight to your phone. All right, guys, that's all I have. See you later.